Hi there, everybody. We are in step three of the second section of this uh, guide, Calm Guide, uh, creating easy access for your members to join your Mighty Network. And we're talking about different doors to access the Mighty Network. We just discussed the private uh, Muddy Network setup, and I'm going to just quickly review the public Muddy Network setup. Um, the Muddy Hosts is a great example, so I'm just going to use that one because it's easy and everybody's familiar with it. So um, the Muddy Hosts community is a public Muddy Network, so people can search in there, they can peek in, they can see content, they can see posts, they can see comments. They can't comment on anything, and they can't... Um, basically click on anything. It's just like a viewable screen um, as a public network. And um, the other thing is, is that it, there's no paid option. So when you have a public money network, um, it's just you're going right to either join or explore. And so explore can mean they see all the pu public content and they see like the paid course sections but they don't see uh, how they can comment until they actually say join and then they put their email in and they join and then you can comment, comment and post and all that good stuff. Uh, search engine optimization would be the primary reason for this. If you do have a public um, website and you're really wanting to have a search engine optimization is what they call it, SEO. Um, that is the, the, the pro, those two things, basically people can look in there and see if your money network is somewhere they want to be before they join. Um, and then the search engine optimization means that you can create the section um, in money network so that it's searchable in Google. So Google indexes content and posts on your main page. And then um, when people are typing information in like your network name, and then maybe something related to a post that would come up in Google, and it would take them to the link to come to see your network. That, those are the two reasons why you might want a public network. The cons, uh, because you cannot charge at the door, it's a free public, is a free network, so you can't charge for membership. Um, you know, you can charge for courses or other things when you get in the network, but as far as just the network itself, you can't charge for that because uh, it is free and public. The privacy issues, uh, as far as if there's comments that your members post, if there are topics or questions or polls, um, that might be an issue for you if you have a network that's talking about some sensitive topics or uh, even just, uh, you know, a business conversation. Maybe people who are business, if it's an entrepreneurial network, for example, networking group, a business networking group, um, they might not want people to, to have that searchable. <laughs> like maybe they're talking about their clients and they would rather have a private space. So if they see it's public, they're like, oh no, because my client could see anything that I put in here. <laughs> so those are some like just back end things that you might not think about, but you would want to think about as far as the user experience for the, the member that's coming in, what they might see or think. And then the your host perspective, um, even if you have the ability to have the SEO and um, allowing members, you know, to peek in. It also brings the value down because then they're less likely to join if they don't think it's for them. And they also, you know, if there, it's a free community, we've already seen a lot of in this, we talk about in a lot of our Find Calm Here sessions, people pay what they value and value what they pay for. And so when you have a free money network in any capacity, people generally don't spend a lot of time in those communities unless they're super invested in a topic. So those are just things to think about. Uh, we will go to the next section. I don't ha have a lot more to discuss with public because I don't think that most people do the public option. I think they're either doing private or a combination of the paid. We're going to get into the paid next, so stay tuned.